Hey guys, so in this video, we're going to discuss about setting up products, price books, and price book entries in Salesforce. You can create multiple price books in Salesforce and you can also add one product to multiple price book. Let's say you would want to set up a holiday discount every year for specific products. For this, you would need to create separate price book for each holiday. So the first thing that you need to do is to log into your Salesforce account. Go to App Launcher and look for products. So in here, you can see a new button located on the upper right hand corner of your screen. Just click on that. Type in the product name. So I'm going to create a laser painter product. I'm going to set this to active. You can then select a product family. So just take note that you can customize this pick list based on your business. So I'm going to type in the product code. You may also want to put some descriptions and once you're done, just hit save. You now have a product record. So this product should be added into the standard price book before you can add this to a custom price book. It's like a master list of all of your price book and standard prices. Just click on related. Add a standard price. So in here, I'm going to set the standard price of this laser printer to 4000 And just click on save. So once a product has been added in the standard price book, it will automatically be entered as a standard price book entry, which also known as the default or standard prices for the products and services in the standard price book. So the next step would be creating a custom price book or a separate list of products with custom prices. And our goal here is to have a discounted price for our newly created products, which is the laser printer. And in order to do that, just go to App Launcher, look for price book, click on new, and enter the price book name. So in here, I'm gonna put Christmas sale price book. Don't forget to click the active checkbox. Otherwise, you won't be able to add this price book into the opportunity. You also have an op option to use the standard price, though we're not going to use that since our goal here is to have a custom price list for our Christmas sale promo. Go ahead and save. So once you have successfully created a custom price book, you can now create a price book entry. Price book entry is a product with its price as listed in a price book. So there are two ways to add a price book entry. You can add it directly from the product page. So let's go back to the laser printer or the product record. Click on related tab. Then click on add to price book. So when you click on the arrow down under the price book, you can see that we now have an option to add our product to the Christmas sale price book. So I'm going to select that. You can also add a currency and click on next. So in here, you will have an option to put a discounted price. So I'm going to put in 3,500. Click on save. All right. So another option is you can also go directly to the price book where you want your product to be added to. So let's say this is the cost of price book. Just click on related tab. And you can also and you can add the products from here. Just click add products and type in the product name. So when you go to the product record, click on related. You will see that the product is now added to the standard and custom price book. You can also see that the price is different for a standard and for our Christmas sale price book. When you go to the opportunity record 
and add products. You now have an option to add either the standard price book or custom price book, which is the Christmas sale price book. So this is how you create product, price book, and price book entry in Salesforce.